we're on part three. I've just been on there and I've just seen right. the lovely toilet. Yeah. Okay, so let's what's have, going on here? Out, right? Wow. That's another steam cabin, yeah. but it's for two wow. people. So you and Ed, oh, once you've been running. Uh, so it works exactly the same as the other one, it's, uh, but of course it's rectangular rather than uh, obvious like the other one. I was going to say, that's a, that's a steam dulux. Well, it is. Yeah, so shower heads in the top. Uh, can, you imagine a the... can you imagine having a shower together? Like, hello, you sit on there, please, and I'll sit on there. <laughs> uh, wow, that is impressive. The amount, the amount of people that we ask, uh, that, that come in and ask for us to have like double steam cabins or double baths. Really? Yeah, all of that. So the only thing we haven't been asked for yet is a double toilet, but I'm sure someone will come up. With <laughs> can you imagine? I'll have, I'll have a double remote control, please. <laughs> wow. How much is that? I should have a double one. Four and a half, five thousand pounds, something like that. Wow. That's uh, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's not that, oh. Oh, Someone's hello. calling him. Yeah, it, come and use the it, it might be the car phone warehouse. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? Hello. Oh, it's okay. it's his, it's the Williams' mum. Oh, oh right. but, but she's okay. like that. What are you doing in London? Why are you in London with this? Woman? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what are you doing there? <laughs> Wow. So, um, yeah, this is for smaller places uh, when you've not got enough space for like a big old shower. You can pull these around the front of your bath like that. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay, and they come in various sizes. You can move them around a wee bit. That's really clever. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool because half the time it gets rid of that nasty shower curtain. That's right, yeah. So, you don't need that and it can fold all the way back to the wall. That's really, really compact because sometimes you see these showers, like I say, you've been here where you've got the cubicle and people want sort of like streamlined. That's right, that's right. So you just shove it all it's back out. Brilliant. Away, fetch it back around into the front, meets in the middle, nice little enclosure there for about 800 quid, less than that. That's not bad. Yeah. That's not bad at all. I'm liking that. Yeah, I'm liking so you that. want one of those, you want a steam cabin and you want the toilet. Christ, we're going on, aren't we? I'm going, I'm going to want the, the glass thing. So the chaise yeah, yeah. longue. How yeah. is your car? We've got to get it all a in Peugeot. Uh, we'll need a bigger car. <laughs> Peugeot 207. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to go in. It's not going to happen. So what's, what's, what we got oh, here then? Standard bars for standard bathrooms, really. Yeah. Straight on here, there's a more curvy one here with a big curved shower screen. Curvy Perfect curvy for the curvy lady. But for the curvy lady. But frankly, if you're that shape, you probably need more than a marathon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> I was going to say, I'm going to go in there, please. The curvy bath. Oh dear, you two are funny. Sorry. This is brilliant. Matt's getting so, so yeah. Oh, so um, we've got the cloakroom basins. Cloakroom basins. Yeah, they're, they're not exactly cloakroom. I was going to say, these look like my daughter would like this. In, well, yeah, in they're, they're not really for the doll giant, houses, I was going, Oh, okay. They're, they're not dollhouse ones then, no, no, okay. They're, they're, pro they're proper grown up, uh, proper grown up bases. Very the nice. Small rooms, the small rooms, you know, as you can see, they're tiny. Do you have a roll top bath? We do don't you? have any roll top baths in. We can get them. Yeah. They're not very popular because they're mostly cast iron and they're hugely heavy. Yeah. It's but more of an in vogue thing and what a trend. That's right. Yeah. You can get acrylic ones, which are much less heavy. Yeah. Uh, but they're very few. Yeah, because I was going to say some homes will do, don't they? This is a very this, beautiful this is, bath. This is the star of the show. That um, is um, massive. Yeah, it's called the Calder Wine Bassino. It's, wow. It's uh, two meters long by one meter wide, and it's only about half the depth of a normal bath. Well, Ed said something about when you put the water in, right. it floats. What you do? I'm you getting a demonstration. Wee, you've got your wee cushion here. Yeah. Which you stick behind your head when you're when you're laying down. So that's yeah. what floats on there. You put your head on and you lift your feet up and you actually float in it. Wow. As opposed to sitting in it as you would with a normal bath. Wow. And this here is a shelf that can be moved around, so you can put your champagne. Bed. Cakes and biscuits. You want Cakes and biscuits. <laughs> a bit of a bit of Lucas Aid on there, I think. <laughs> I mean, actually, it's probably strong enough to take Ed, so okay. you can sit on there if you wanted to. I was going to say, I'm, I think I'm a lot heavier than him. <laughs> well, it strong, enough to, strong enough to take me, so you've got no worries. Fabulous. Look at the size on that. And how much would something like that set me back? It's about four and a half grand. 
Okay, so we've got that and we've got the toilet and we've got, oh, it's tottering up quite nicely yeah, now. Yeah, it's, it's I've got a big bathroom. You've got, you've got a lot of walls to sell. I was right? going to say, I need a lot of walls to sell. Yeah. Okay, so what we got here then? Yeah, oh, I like is, the shapes of these ones. This, this one here is the Laufen Alessi One. Wow. Sweet. Oh. Um, for obvious reasons, we call this the Egg Loop. I'll put the lid down you'll see. Wow. Oh wow, look at that, it's like an egg. Yeah, that's the egg glue. An egg glue? Yeah. Well, I want an egg glue. <laughs> look at that. Oh, and it's a jacuzzi. Yeah, well, it's not a jacuzzi. jacuzzi. Oh no. Oh, jacuzzi oh. is a trade name. You have to be careful oh. about that. These oh, are whirlpools. Oh, These whirlpool. Little faux pas there, we'll let you off. Sorry. Um, so yeah, that is the, the bath that goes with it. It's 190 centimetres long by uh, 90 centimetres wide. So is that a massive. speaker in it? That is not a speaker in it, no. Oh, <laughs> right. <laughs> I have to check, because there's no so state of the art. It's you have to a, check. It's a water filter. It's got lights in it. It does Has it? Yeah, they'll flash on and off while you're dancing. This around. looks like something that you would probably get in the Dorchester Hotel. Mm -hmm. uh, you could do. You yeah, could do, you yeah. Could do. Yeah. Uh, basically, you've got uh, whirlpool jets around the outside that move water around. On the base of it, all the little holes, they're air jets. That is unbelievable. That's the filter that actually sucks the water through. Sucks right. The water through, Stops the all the fluff and things going through into the system. Yeah. Keeps the water Belly circulating in the pipes nice and clean and uh, recycles it back out of all the jets, which also swivel, swivel nozzle, uh, swivel swivel nozzles, swivel nozzles, is it? Yeah. 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 So you can act, you can point it at yourself if you really want it. Or somebody else, mm. depending on yeah. who's there with it. That's very, very impressive. And if you spin around 180 degrees from where you are. Okay.